Welcome. Today we are starting with microbiology, systemic bacteriology. All the bacteria we'll look at. The first bacteria we're looking at today is Staphylococcus. Uh, this is the nutrient agar. You will have yellow, golden yellow pigmentation from Staphylococcus, right? And uh, the pigment is carotenoid. Okay, it's written here. Can you see? Carotenoid is the yellow pigment or nutrient agar. Okay. You can learn all these colony shapes and all that. You might need it. Circular, smooth, convex, opaque, 2 to 4 millimeter in diameter, etc. The other things you need to know is blood agar. Blood agar, it will, uh, uh, there will be beta type of hemolysis. That much if you know, it's enough. Beta type of hemolysis. McConkey, you will have pink color. Fine. Selective media for staph will be the uh, salt milk agar and Ludlum's media that is uh, telluride, lithium chloride and telluride. These two are the selective media for staph aureus. Please now everybody wake up and tell me the two, the two selective media for staph aureus. Salt milk agar and Ludlam's media that is lithium chloride and telluride that is Ludlam's media okay the salt milk agar will have NaCl I am writing here NaCl will be there this one will have lithium chloride and telluride what is this media Ludlam Ludlam medium fine one more you should know that is uh, <clears throat> mannitol salt agar. Mannitol salt agar actually has 1% mannitol and 7.5% 1% mannitol and 7.5% salt which is this media? Mannitol salt agar. For what will you use? Isolation of staphylococcus or yes, it will again form yellow. Okay, it's positive, acidic. Can you remember this? However, Staphylococcus epidermidis will cause red color pigmentation to be negative. Okay, so <clears throat> so we can use this media mannitol salt agar to differentiate between Staphylococcus aureus and Staphylococcus epidermidis. Correct? So just revise the uh, all the main culture media: nutrient agar, yellow color pigmentation because of carotenoid. Then you have um, and in blood agar. You will have beta hemolysis. The selective media that you should know salt milk agar, rudlam media. And to differentiate Staphylococcus aureus and Staphylococcus epidermidis, you can use mannitol salt agar. This is for isolation of Staphylococcus aureus only. Okay.